All right, we're here at Cato MX with Joe Brillo and his younger son Joey today, racing the Arma AHRMA series here at Cato MX in Cato, New York. Joe, how was your day today at Cato? Oh, great. I, uh, I won the 250 Expert class, and um, I crashed myself senseless on the Open Expert class. <laughs> right. But, yeah, how, how was the track? Fantastic. What yeah. a great day. I mean, just a, a great, great venue for these bikes, and, you know, just couldn't ask for a better day. Joey, how about you? What did you think of the track? I really liked it. Last year, I didn't like the track so much, but now that I got my new bike, I'm really starting to like it a lot. Yeah, what do you think of the new bike? You look pretty fast today. Uh, I really like it. It's yeah? A lot, faster. a lot faster? You beat that guy in the end. What happened? Uh, I guess he crashed in that corner. Yeah? Well, it happens. And uh, he almost caught you at the end, but it looks like you held him off pretty good. All right, good job, Joey. Joe, you got the restored Can-Ams I see here. They look great. Yeah, oh, thanks. Maybe you can tell uh, tell us about the uh, history of that. Where did you buy it and what did you start with and so on? Okay, I started with this 250, not exactly this one, but when I was 16 years old, 1980. Right. And um, I just had a miserable time with it, so I wanted to see, you know, what I did wrong with it. So I bought this probably uh, six, seven years ago. Restored. That long ago, really? Okay. Yep. and then I bought the open bike this year just made it out of parts right and um, just found out really how to make them run just, you know a little bit of knowledge being 16 dumb and no money uh, <laughs> was not the hot setup <laughs> <laughs> right so uh, about restoring the old bikes what is it about that that uh, that you really enjoy I, you know it's great therapy um, I, I have a couple sponsors who really help me out uh, Bond Way is this Can-Am guru right Can-Am dealer in the 70s and I have MX Power uh, you know, helps me out with you know, folding parts and stuff, so uh, the parts have been pretty easy. Uh, okay. Really good experience. Where, where did you get the parts for the older bike? Um, you know, actually eBay, um, the road tax motors, so they still kind of make motors. Um, suspension components are uh, race tech, you know, which are modern components that you can add to it. And uh, really, it's, it's, it's probably easier now than it was in 1980. Really? Yeah. Really? Okay. So good. That sounds like a really fun hobby. How long? How long have you been in the Arma organization? I started racing Arma in 1989. Wow. Okay. The nice thing about these old bikes is uh, the next year it's still an old bike. <laughs> it doesn't right. get outdated. That's right. Well, I tell you, it looks like an exciting, exciting organization. The uh, the old school style here is definitely uh, the camaraderie and the the. Uh, Laid back atmosphere is it's a great, great thing. So oh, it, it's a lot of fun. And, you know, and for the price of these two bikes, it's not a third or a ticket back. It's not a quarter of what a new bike. Right, it right. For two bucks. And it looks like you're just having a blast. It is great. That's great. There's some good battles out there today. Good old school battles. <laughs> <laughs> so what's next for Joe Brillo? Where are you riding tomorrow? Um, you know, I think I'm gonna take tomorrow off and just uh, finally work around the house, maybe mow my lawn. Uh huh. <laughs> All right. But do that. But uh, you know, we'll be back at it. John Frackleton helps me out a lot. Okay. Um, with equipment and parts, and uh, you know, we'll be say back hi, at John. It. <laughs> all right, great. And I'm then a rider from the '70s, an old expert, so uh, we'll all have fun. Okay. And then your plans for the season? Are you just gonna kind of take it week to week, or what? Yeah, we go week to week, and um, you know, we all, me and John, and. and uh, our two sons. We go to the we're races again. We go to uh, we run the the national in Ohio and we hit a couple other nationals. So nice. Time. Okay, great. Well, there you have it, Joe Brillo at Cato MX racing vintage on the Can Am MX6 250. Is it? This is an MX5. MX5. Okay, great. Well, we'll be looking forward to seeing you next time. All right, thanks. See All right, bro.